Let's take a look at Azure Synapse Analytics, and this is a data warehouse and a unified analytics platform. We're gonna talk more about the latter, cause like, you know what a data warehouse at this point, it's just a column or store. Uh, and so here is a visual of um, the data analytics or um, data uh, Synapse's studio. So here you can see there's a query going on. So we're just querying data but there's a lot we can do uh, on the unified analytics platform. So we can perform ETL and ELT processes in a code-free uh, visual environment. So you don't have to write any code using ingest data from more than 95 native connectors, um, deeply integrated with Apache Spark, uses TSQL queries on both your data warehouse and Spark engines. Just that's what we're looking at there is the TSQL and supports multiple languages. So TSQL, Python, Scala, Spark, SQL, and .NET. And it's integrated with artificial intelligence, so AI and business intelligence tools, BI. So we could use Azure Machine Learning Studio or Azure Cognito Services. Um, or Microsoft Power BI, just to get a better visual of the entire flow here. On the left-hand side, you're ingesting uh, data from sources. All the data is gonna be stored on a data lake uh, uh, storage gen two here. At the top here, we have the Azure Synapse Analytics Studio. So that's where you're gonna be doing um, the interface you're gonna be working with. And then you're gonna be able to output them to various services. And notice here that we have SQL and Apache Spark, which are the different runtime engines. This really looks like to me uh, a data lake uh, or lake house, which when I was talking about lake house, I was like, Azure doesn't have an offering. But now that I'm looking at the screenshot, this definitely is um, a data lake house. So yeah, I guess Azure Syn uh, Synapse is a, a data lake house. Cool.